Hey everyone, Matt from SoundRolling.com, and I wanted to do fun little comparisons with the Qubit, the Nano Locket, the UltraSync One, and the Tentacle. Uh, this is version one of the Tentacle, not the new one yet. Still waiting, guys. Send it to me whenever you have it. Um, so first, uh, form factor. Uh, the smallest is definitely the Qubit. Um, you can also get a five-pin Limo version of this, which actually makes the BNC a little shorter. Um, and then, otherwise, it's about the same as the Tentacle. Uh, it's definitely a little bit thinner. Um, they kind of feel the same weight as well, but I'll uh, throw up all the all the weights above each one. And then uh, we have the size as well. So even the Nano Locket is uh, pretty much the biggest at the moment, very similar. Um, and then battery life. Um, we have, I've put up all of them through the magic of post-production, but the Qubit is less, but it does have a, a constant power source, and ideally it's meant to be plugged in with this four-pin Hiroshi, but still getting four or five hours out of something so tiny is uh, really, really impressive. So if form factor is a key for you, um, then that is that. They all do uh, the same usual frame rates that you can see everywhere. Uh, the only ones with a display is the UltraSync, um, really like the layout of the Qubit, um, so I just, I guess I'll talk about what I like about each one. Qubit, really like, uh, just for its simplicity, just an on button, turn the dial round, and then you can just plug it in, and you're ready to go. And uh, Nano Locket, it's great because it's on the ACN network, uh, you can wirelessly sync two of them together, three of them, four of them, five of them. Um, and yeah, very simple form factor again, with kind of three buttons kind of looking like a big speaker. So it's always good to have stylish design, and it is rock solid. It probably is uh, the heaviest one slightly, um, but that's just because of the aluminium case, and uh, you can really feel the kind of strength, and yeah, don't have to worry too much about that getting chucked around. Um, the probably the nicest feeling one, which is kind of like this rubbery uh, plastic, I guess, is the UltraSync, and the UltraSync is amazing because it's got the word clock, gen lock, um, LTC and uh, what I like to call normal time code, as in you're just plugging it in through um, an actual time code connection as opposed to an audio track. And the Tentacle. I love these guys when they first came out. I had them uh, do a live webinar and actually help them uh, secure their Kickstarter funding, uh, which I'm very proud to be a part of because they literally changed uh, the way we kind of think of uh, how, especially how small these things can be and how easy they are so that just kind of the one plug in and uh, it's all based around uh, plugs but they're soon to develop their own network as well so just wanted to kind of give you a little fun overview of uh, all four of these and uh, I'll be testing them all uh, rigorously um, and doing little tutorial videos on them I'm sure you've already seen some come out already but make sure you get down in the comments below and let me know what you'd like to know about each one or even uh, which one uh, compares better to another one on a certain feature because um, there's definitely lots of content to be made um, but no matter kind of what what preference or what uh, situation you're in any one of these that are next to you um, are going to give you rock solid time code and they're going to be really really useful so join me next time for another amazing video